Hello everyone, thank you for reading my blog. Um, I just wanted to introduce you to a few products that I did put in my blog about enlightenment and how to become enlightened and products we should use while we're on our journey to enlightenment. Um, one product that I talked about in my blog uh, was the Kiss My Face deodorant. And like I said, this is paraben free, alumina free, um, it's made with rosemary and natural herbs and flowers to make you smell good. There's nothing in this that is toxic at all. And that's called Kiss My Face. And these could be found at local natural food stores. But if you don't live near a natural food store, um, all of these products that I'm going to show you can be bought from Amazon.com. So that's the Kiss My Face uh, deodorant. And the other one is crystal and it's it's hard it's like a rock and what you do is you just moisten it with water or I moisten it with rose water and then I put it on from there and this will actually last six months to a year I know a lot of people complain that a lot of these products are very expensive but this will actually last for a year and once again, this has no parabens or aluminum, so it's, it's very safe. And next uh, was the Toms. And like I said in my blog about Toms, um, a lot of Toms have gone mainstream, meaning if you find these products in Target and Walmart, then they probably have parabens in them, they probably have aluminum in them. Um, but if you do go to a natural food store, um, you can find the ones that are natural and don't have any aluminum or parabens in them, like this one. This one's 100% natural. And as I put in my blog as well about the rose water, I use rose water daily. Um, when I get out of the shower and I dry myself off, I drench myself in this. Um, this keeps the vibrations high and it even puts it there on the label. And this is one of my favorite kinds because it is certified. Um, so you know that they're using 100% real rose petals to make this. This is not artificial. It's a 100% 100% rose that went into making this rose water. And I mentioned about the toothpaste. And this is the Kiss My Face toothpaste. It's made with aloe and xylitol. If you're not familiar with xylitol, xylitol is a sugar that reverses cavities. It's natural, it's amazing. Um, there's no fluoride. I go in detail on my blog about why not using fluoride. It does shrink the pineal gland. So if you are trying to become enlightened, um, fluoride is not a good product to put into your body. I know it's in the drinking water and things like that, but the last thing you want to do is deliberately put it into your mouth, into your system. So this is the Kiss My Face, um, and I'm out of my 24 Herbal Toothpaste, which is a great one as well. It has 24 herbs in it, and I love that one as well. And I was also talking about alcohol and diet and things like that. Um, in my blog and about becoming enlightened and how a lot of people who are enlightened don't drink alcohol and I was saying in my blog how if you buy organic wine um, this has no sulfates in it and if you look here it says no sulfates added no G GMO yeast added none of those bad things if you look on the label here it says contains no detectable sulfates so this is like grown from the earth I don't think anything that's fresh and grown from the earth would be a bad thing to put in your body so I would say stick to organic wines organic beers organic champagnes they're out there and um, this is one of my favorites it's called Frey and I recommend this one it's also called a vegan wine or organic wine and no all wines are not organic so make sure it says organic on the label and this is very good wine this bottle's empty because I drank it not by myself but and last but not least I wanted to talk about the white sage this is white sage and one thing I said about becoming enlightened 
when you're starting to become enlightened, you might get a lot of negativity, a lot of negative thoughts, um, a lot of negative things uh, going on, maybe in your home or whatever. I burn this daily. Sometimes uh, once a month, I will burn a lot, you know, in my house and walk it through my home and it gets rid of a lot of negative energy. And you can also burn this and if you're having negative thoughts, just the smell of it will get rid of the negative thoughts. You can also boil this, like I boiled some today and I put it in my tea kettle to have my water infused with it so that I could mix it in with my tea. And it also helps as well. You can take a bath with it. It helps relieve stress and tension in the muscles. So this is a really, really, um, good herb, good plant to use. Once again, it's called white sage. If you do not live near a natural health food store, it can also be bought on amazon.com. All these products can be bought on amazon.com. So when you feel the negativity creeping in, this is a great, great positive reinforcement right here. So I want to thank you for reading my blog. Thank you for looking at my YouTube video and peace, love, and light.